Hello people, this is Eric Copa and this is Let's Play Shadow Warrior Blind. Apparently a sort of remake, you might say, of an older game made by um, Flying Hawk Studios. The guys behind Hard Reset, which I liked. And they were also the ones who uh, helped create part of they were also part of the team that made Painkiller, which I also liked until somebody else got their hands on it and kinda got shit. But yeah. And this should be apparently more of the same, so yeah, let's get into this and kill things. Would be nice, you know. Let's play it normal, you know, just pure hack and slash. Okay. So yeah. I don't know anything about the original. I think it was something about, you know, there being an evil corporation or something like that. That's about the gist of it. Uh, and it involved a guy from Japan. So yeah. You know what, I'm just gonna skip this loading screen for you. Ain't I nice? Of course, as you might point out, if I let you skip the loading screen, the loading screen will also go quicker, so I also get some from it. Well, you'd be right. <clears throat> so, let's see. Our deaths are laid upon us at birth. Uh. Rulers or subjects, we are all prisoners of the Great Wheel. Huh. Escape is the fancy of a child. Freedom, the cruelest illusion. Still, there are some that would try. Those who would burn the world to rule it. Yeah, okay. But I will defend you to the last. I promise you, sister. Well, that we are the ancients. Could we get some subtitles, man? Ancient. We may not prosper, but we will prevail. Yeah, could you like make the subtitles prevail? Because. I have trouble hearing you, and you're kind of cutting off my commentary. I should probably check. But I just thought subtitles would be kind of, you know... You got the touch! What? You got the power! What? The fuck? Okay, well let's go find Optimus Prime and go beat up Frieza! The hell? You got Wang! Mr. Wang, this is Orochizilla. Ah, uh, I, I, I'm sorry. I'm on my way, sir. I can't talk. I'm, uh, pre-visualizing. Things have changed. You need to bring me the Nobitsurakage. I need it today. No problem, sir. The guy's gonna sell two million bucks for a shitty old sword. Well, if he doesn't, just get it. Even if things get dirty. If he doesn't, I need to apply the touch. You got the touch! Goddamn right! You got the power! Yeah, okay, why not? When the hell's breaking loose, you'll be right I mean, if we had the money, I'm pretty sure most of us would do something like this. Right? Okay, maybe not exactly this song. It's a good song, but not all as I like more. Hey, smoking will kill ya, I've been told. Oh! 
first person camera. Does that mean I get to control it a moment? Ooh, pretty! Yeah, so first things first, uh... Would it be here? No. Here? Ah, here they are. You know, it's a silly assumption, but I always think they're just gonna make those mandatory. I mean, who doesn't put on subtitles? Well, some don't, but... Let's see. Briefcase full of cash, blade, a million dollar smile. Ready for school, Ma. Hey! So yeah, this looks pretty with the Sakura Freeze, I think they're called. They're all over Japan. In spring, I have been told it makes the whole country look, you know, like candy floss. But they're pretty, no doubt about that. Let's just look around. There might be a secret or something like that hidden somewhere. You know how these people are. Yep, here I am to sell something. Now excuse me while I go down this road. I'm pretty sure this is going to weird out everyone. How far down this road can I go? Doesn't seem like there's anything down here. Is there anything down here? It says the road will end, but will it? I guess we'll find out. Is there even a point to this, or are they just trolling me at this point? I'm starting to ponder. Hmm, let's check what the next sign says. Road ends. Well, that's something. Is that like a different game you got in there? Huh. Okay then. Fair enough. I'll let those guys do whatever it is they're doing behind the fake screen. So yeah. Now we're just gonna walk all the way back. I wonder if I should sing a song to light the mood while we travel. If so, what song should it be? Hmm. Maybe a classic from my home country. No, no, I use that song every time. It's a classic song from my home country. Um, it's going to get same even for me. How about... Oh, a short one, I know. Mr. Jacob, Mr. Jacob, so do, so do. Here to a clock and here to a clock and bim bum boom, bim bum boom. It's a very simple one for children, but I like it. Still do. Now let's check this road. Wait, if road ends both directions, then how the fuck did I arrive? Doesn't this just raise some questions? So yeah, that's gonna be the first part of this game. Walking down bamboo roots to roads to nowhere. I guess you could say it's bamboo roots, like a route to somewhere, but it's a route to nowhere. Or an and a road to nowhere. I guess you could use both phrases, really. Though the classic is, of course, Road to Nowhere. Anyway, this one wasn't nearly as long. So yeah, Road ends here. And behind this curtain is... what? There's these sidewalks everywhere. 
Well, they don't really look like they're from this game. No, they look kind of still shaded. Like they're from a different game entirely. So yeah, if both roads are dead end like this, how did I fight? You know, it's funny, most games will probably just have, you know, set up an invincible wall at the start. I still thought they would maybe do, um, do something like that and just the character go, no, I have to sell stuff, turn around. But no, you can actually walk down to these dead ends. Apparently there's absolutely no fucking point, but if you want to, hey, go ahead. I mean, there's nothing to get, apparently. I really thought it would be something. Anything. But I guess it wouldn't be as simple as that to get the secrets. Oh no, they couldn't make it as simple as that. They never do. If you want secrets, you have to jump through all kinds of hoops. Sometimes they'll give you a freebie, but you know the first one's always free. That's how they get. That's how they sucker you in. Well, let's start exploring the rest of this complex. Ooh, a rabbit. Hm. Hey. Fishy. Hey, this is quite pretty. I certainly wouldn't mind living in a place like this. It's beautiful. I mean, it would probably cost a lot. Not only to buy, but to maintain. I mean, are you crazy? But still, wouldn't mind it. It's pretty. I could imagine having some serene summer days, lounging around out here. Ah, they're opening up their anticipation of me, but I won't be around just yet, I'm still looking around. I guess with all this open ground will become important later, maybe we have to battle out here, but if not... Well, even if that is the case, I really like how they just allow me to wander around. There's absolutely nothing to do but look at the gorgeous scenery, but I'm allowed to! If I wanna fuck around out here all day, the kids just gonna sit back and say, You do that. I do hope they keep this up, 